Good evening. Good evening, everyone. How's everybody doing? Good. Good. My name is uh, Bell Yen, and uh, I'm currently a trustee for the Peralta Community College Board. I just wanted to acknowledge Council Member Desley Brooks, who's here as well. So I just wanted to acknowledge you for being here. Thank you for coming. Uh, and, and much like Hal Jin, actually, I'm the first Latino ever to get elected to the Peralta Community College District and the youngest. Uh, I think it's a sad testament that uh, Asian Americans and Latinos and other folks are still breaking barriers. Uh, but that's where we are today. Uh, I'm very much, I'm very happy and very proud to be here in front of you. Uh, my parents are hardworking uh, union folks. My dad works at the Hilton Hotel. He's been there for 39 years. And he's very proud of the, the job that he's done there uh, in the hospitality business. My mom is a cook. My mom is a cook at a hospital. She's been there for over 30 years. And these are uh, good jobs that were union jobs. And they allowed my family to be able to raise me and my brother so that I could become the first in my family to graduate from college. Unfortunately, today, that opportunity of uh, California being golden is being diminished. And no longer can people afford to go to school. No longer can people access health care. I've been on the Peralta Community College Board the last six years. And unfortunately, while we've been able to provide good education to a lot of students, the state has reneged on its promise. So I'm running for the State Assembly to make sure that other next generations has the opportunities that I've had and to make sure that here in California, everyone has health care and that we have a prosperous uh, environment for our small businesses, for our community. So um, there's going to be a lot of questions and answers during the period. So I would like to just, uh, again, thank you for uh, being here. And again, my name is Abel Guillen. Thank you everyone for coming out tonight. Uh, very honored to be here uh, with these great candidates on the stage. Very honored to have the opportunity to introduce Joel Young to you. Uh, as the moderator announced, he's, he's on his way. He'll be here shortly. Um, Joel Young is currently the AC Transit Director at large, representing 13 cities in Alameda and Contra Costa County. Uh, he has strong roots here in this community. He was born in San Francisco. He went to schools here, went to Cal for undergrad at Cal Berkeley Law. Um, Joel has been working uh, his whole life to try and create opportunity for the residents of this district. Uh, he's running on a campaign now and he has a very simple message. And his message is jobs here. Uh, to do anything with government, we need more revenue for the state. To generate more revenue for the state, we need to grow our economy, get our economy back on track, create jobs here in the community. Uh, Joel has a strong record of action creating jobs at the AC Transit Board. Uh, he passed a Buy American resolution in 2009 that steered agency dollars to local businesses. Uh, just a few weeks ago, the agency signed a bus contract to purchase 60 buses from a company called Gillig that's in Hayward. Uh, it's going to help preserve hundreds of jobs, middle class jobs. Uh, that's exactly what Joel wants to do up in the state legislature. Uh, California spends billions of dollars every year purchasing materials, buying services. Uh, and when California spends that money, it should be investing in firms, investing in companies that are creating jobs here in our communities. Uh, so that's Joel's number one priority. Uh, in the state. He's created a very concrete plan to do that. I invite all of you to go to our website. It's www.youngforassembly.com to read that plan. And if you have any questions about it, uh, pl please feel free to, to contact us or to ask Joel about it later in the session. So thank you again for the opportunity to be here. Joel will be here very shortly and uh, hopefully I can represent him in his absence. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Good evening. How's everybody doing tonight? Good. Thank you all for coming on this rainy evening. My name is Rob Bonta. I'm the Vice Mayor of the City of Alameda. I just want to thank Apapa for putting on this, this event, event that will help um, really inform our community about this important race. So thank you for taking the lead on that. My parents were um, leaders in the United Farm Worker Movement. They were community organizers, farm worker organizers. We lived in La Paz when I was a, a child and I grew up learning from them the importance of economic justice and social justice and racial justice. And my parents fought uh, side by side with great leaders like Philip Vera Cruz and Dolores Huerta and Cesar Chavez. And they went on in their careers to continue to serve the public and make a commitment to public service. And they passed that value on to me. And I have fought hard here in the East Bay to fight for better schools and safer streets 
and more prosperous communities. And that's what I want to fight for in Sacramento as well. As uh, Council Member Kernahan mentioned, the decisions that are made in Sacramento are absolutely critical to the health of our local communities. And uh, I'm a product of California's public schools. I was able to fulfill my own personal dream of going to the best colleges and universities in the world because of the quality of those schools. I now, my wife and I have three children, school-aged children. Um, my wife and I met 23 years ago, and with our three school-aged school children, we now worry deeply that they may not be able to fulfill the same dream that I have. And we are threatening um, in this generation to be one of the first times where the next generation's quality of life is not as good as the one prior. Um, and we owe it always to the next generation to provide a better quality of life. For public safety, I have uh, made decisions that ensure that there were no street level service cuts to police and fire protection services, to fire suppression, um, to emergency medical response. And in jobs, we've created jobs, maintained, retained existing jobs, created more jobs in the East Bay, and that's absolutely critical to a healthy California. Um, I finally just want to say something that I will say to my next session. <laughs>